Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. I got Manny with me today. This is a list he's been running for the Faction Challenge Week. As you can see by the name, it's a tribute to one of our... Fallen friends. Fallen friends. <laughs> <laughs> Tragic Star. We, we still love Tragic Star, man. Um, has, he, has he talked about uh, Homecoming? Uh, he's, he's talked about uh, homecoming. He's a little bit reluctant. Um, you know, he's a he's a I gotta see it before I try it kind of thing. And um, so the, see, he's the same for other cards. He's just looking for a card game to play at this point. He's on yeah. limbo. Yeah, I I tried magic. It's just not uh, visually appealing. You don't have the king brand just looking gorgeous. It's these tiny kind of little cards with all these little commanding. Conqueror was all over the place. I, I couldn't get in. I tried to. But, um, we're going to find out today what uh, Homecoming is uh, when we're recording this. So. Uh, let's go through the list, Manny, and uh, explain what we're trying to do here. All right. So, um, as, you might want, as you might see, we're using Brand, and uh, we're using Sears and Great. And the reason for this is because they work really well together, and we're trying to get, you know, just some value on that gold and we're also just thinning the deck uh usually people run um what's the murderum no was it the purple murderum uh wolfsbane okay. yeah they usually people are running wolfsbane and the reason why we're not doing this is because sometimes you just don't get those um long swords and if with this situation you're actually in control of these kind of things uh you can also like buff series with uh you know black hand you can even buff your swordman make them bigger same with your uh you know a lot of stuff it has a really good synergy and the obvious like man no nobody specs the obvious like there yeah you just put that there and sometimes i just throw it as a okay what are you gonna do now i don't even get a proc you know uh they just render uh it's, it's just a surprise card. Uh, as far as the Wild Board of the Sea, that Wild Board of the Sea is pretty much optional. Uh, Igni gets you value these days. Uh, you know, just whatever that gold is pretty much up to you. Uh, we do Wild Board of the Sea because, you know, why not? That's yeah. that's a good day, reason enough for me. And uh, you know, even though the deck has 26 cards, it, it pretty much goes through the entire deck. Yeah, so, Brand is good for that. He's a he's a good shoot uh, leader if you can uh, come up with something good. You, all, you can almost always find shoot. Shoot, uh, get out of here! Get out of here! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think shoot's uh, had his days numbered here coming soon. But um, yeah, plus two octopus is kind of a bait. You know what I mean? You they take it out, yeah, but then they that's one less great sword they can take out. So that's, yeah, man. Uh, pretty good. It's, uh, you up see if we can uh, get some wins with it yeah I actually got that <coughs> list from uh, hitting level 70 great. oh this is the very first card I crafted me. For me. <laughs> mm -hmm. all right all right, so right here for the mulligan, we're gonna throw the three first the cell guy first and then we're gonna throw Cedar way and maybe no roach, no, this is... See, this is a perfect situation, right? We don't have a uh, swordsman, but we're okay with it. Like, we're completely fine with this. So we're keeping this. We're keeping this. I will slop off three heads with one blow. All right, so that's his great sword. Now we're going to start uh, searching for hours. We're going to do uh, Kim Brand. We're going to be a little bit behind, but we're going to... Me! Uh, it would have been really nice if we could have gotten muscle. So we're gonna throw series first, then uh, more work, and then one of this, uh, the the sort of man. We want to flip though, which is nice. And we're going to uh, what's it called? The mother goddess. Oh. she give us and take us away. See, um, the screen is blurry. How much? He has seven HP, right? Who? Yeah, that uh, one, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so then we're just going to rest our, our swordsman. Does it matter what row? Uh, no, just... Put it uh, next. 
put it next to the Morvark, because, you know, in, ca in case. Who is virgin, mother, and crone. Now, are we going to do what he did with the Spear Maiden? Yeah. Because if he has a removal, um, we don't want that to be dead. So, and we're going to put her next to Bran. And, yep, we're going to hit him and put him, like, on the left of Bran. Like that. Yeah. I so, I don't like playing uh, two rows together. Because, you know, sil silver weathers and such. Yeah. Yeah, muscle would have been great. Yeah, if we had muscle, that would have been like, really, really good. But uh, here is where. Uh... Really? Alright, so now we're just going to put. Um... The boat on the 11? No, we're going to put the boat on the one on top. On the one on top. And the reason for that is because if he wants to move it, he's going to fix the, la the lanes or so, uh, for ourselves. Great Sword Wars. And I, he hasn't seen our graveyard. He doesn't know that with this card series. So. So he did move it? So what do he, we do? He did move it. Uh, I think we just give it here. This, is, this is. Yeah, we just pass. Uh, we're gonna try to get that muscle. Yeah, because we got the carrier. <clears throat> yeah, now he has to decide. What is he going to rest? Uh, the the movement or the actual? Um... That's pretty good. Now we gotta be careful with uh, Roach. Roach. Yeah. So we don't throw nothing. No, this is good. <laughs> yeah, we're hard up. Modern Freyr is patient, but she brooks no insult. Yeah, uh, let's see. We gotta rest our Axemen, uh, our great. Swordman, I mean, great sword. Yeah, we're going to raise one. Grab up that 11. Uh, put everything on the same row, because remember he has the other. Either way. Bow before Modern Freya. That one on the left, yeah. I will flop the Playing around uh, Burner, right? Uh, that, that could work, but I, don't, I doubt that he has it. So he has to go for the 2 0? Yeah, he does. Um, so yeah. we just play our boat, right? We play our boat, yes. Now, as long as we could stay up, do we throw out the Aquabus? Um. We're going to. Oh, we're, we we want to get another Axeman going. Ooh. Oh, that's great. We just kill with the Bran. Hogar. Yeah, I mean Hogar. Yes, I gave different names to different individuals. Keep uh. Keep it all in the same row, or. Uh. Doesn't really matter, does it? Let me see. It depends. Let's see. Yeah, keep. Uh, no, no, hang on. That will be. No, no. Put that with next to the the well. And just just hit it. Uh, buff up. So we buff up one of our axemen. That's indirect indirect buffs. So if he passes here, we tie. We yeah. So right here, this is not bad for us. Um, that he only has two axemen, right? Um, yes. And the other one is super tiny. You think maybe he's got the uh, Siri Nova? Oh, well, he doesn't. The, he still has 17 he... cards in his deck. He might have Siri, but like that, that, uh, I, I'm thinking about just using Coral right now. On the 12? Yeah, actually, can we have a boat on the. On the back, right? On the yeah. Okay, so use the one and pull a boat. Just pull the boat out. Just a boat, yeah. We'll get series back out. 
Yeah, because this is, this is what I was thinking of doing the rest. But there is one thing. If he's running series, which I didn't see the beginning, uh, the account, uh, we could just, uh, what's it called? Ship it, you know, with Coral. So he's going Coral on this. Ooh. Well, that's not bad. We, get we throw it there. away. There you go. So right now, I just play that and starting with strengthening the more work. And we put it on the left here, right? Yeah. <clears throat> um, take one out, or we just no, we, we we put the eight just straight up the eight on the right and the right. Yeah, I will flop off three heads with one blow, and we're gonna get the res, right? Yeah, okay. There's no way to keep everything. We have to play our octus now, right? Okay, yes, but I'll tell you, we're going to put it next to the boat with a strengthening of the boat. Yeah, like that. We're going to rest one of the guys with the one, right? The one, uh, we're going to use a restore. We're going to rest the one. We're going to rest a boat, and we're going to make the boat hit Ogvest. Don't put it. Yeah. Okay, so we're going for store. Uh huh. We're gonna rest the one. Uh, we put it next. Uh, we're gonna put it all the way in the left. That guy. We're gonna play a three guy. All the one left. And then the boat is going to hit off this. And the reason for this is because if he if he ships it, then this is this is free damn free free for us, right? Right. And if not, then. Uh, he has to deal with this. Modern Freyr is patient, but she brooks no insult. Do we just ship that or uh, coral that now? Wait. I think we can wait one. Uh, we let's let's we rest. Play the, the, we play the great sword right in between here. Huh? No, no, the great sword we're gonna play it all the way in the back. Let the, that just go, grow by itself. But she goes, yeah, um, she goes all the way. In she goes to the front and the great sword goes all the way in the back. The goddess protects you from all the evil. 15, yeah. I'm great. Yeah, it's the weather's actually a uh, detriment. Mm hmm. We'll forget up, well, Fred. So the okay. last one is uh, Jenga. Yep, yeah, so you just ship the, the great sword, the, the highest value. And... Uh, I suppose, and the end. I really doubt that he's coming out of this one. Yeah, it's gonna be tough. I haven't got all day. I mean, he gets a good nuke on the front row, but Octus comes back full strength. Yeah. And then you play Octus the one. You don't even have to, this. You can be a nice guy here, dude. Oh wait, let me see. Can you? Yeah. We <laughs> 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 <I'm> just gonna. <laughs> That was that was really effective, really yeah. effective. I like it. Um, if you were running a normal brand deck, you wouldn't have a swordman to keep up with, right? See? So then that's that's kind of like the plus. I forgive you. This okay, thing. here is the counter. I'm glad that uh, I'm glad we're getting out of, in here with you guys. You know, let's be honest, dude. The vipers are a pain. Yeah, yeah, they light you up pretty bad. Yeah, um, so we're going to do series, and then I think we won the rest. Triple boat is fine, actually, but let's just throw a boat away. One boat? Yeah. Roach away. This, this is not necessarily bad. <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm getting nervous just fighting against, uh, you know, Calvet. <laughs> do not assume you can oh, order me that. around. Whoa. Now, how did that incantation go? So did we just pass? I think we do. I mean, yeah, you, you got it, dude. <laughs> He's got Cantarella in hand. And then we put more one. Yeah. We just keep it. Or do you think he goes... He can't go for the 2-0, can he? Unless he's got... Um... 
pull buff. Oh, keep all the... No, we throw more work. Even if I prefer having a roach or a more work. Ah, we don't have gold. So do we let him kill the boats first? No, we're just gonna let him kill the the what's called the great swords. If magic dies, this world dies with it. Hmm. All right, so um, this is what we're gonna do. We're going to put um, our brand. Do we play around expired ale? Oh yeah, we're gonna put the only play on two rows. All right, so we play brand, uh, brand, and then we discard series more work. And this is uh, one of the cool parts. You're going to discard um, one of the the wrestler guys, the the, the ones that wrestle both. Actually, we'll, we'll hang, hang on, wait a second. We're gonna discard the one. Yeah, I was gonna say. We can yeah, it's better we, we do the one. Just one more, sir. I uh, honestly, to be completely honest, if we don't kill any of his, if he passes, this is really bad for him. Yeah, because they get their ointments and stuff in hand if it's alchemy. Yeah, and, and right now we're looking good. Yeah, hopefully we can hit Olgar series and not this uh walkie well he buffs the, the the biggest one so we're actually aiming let, letting him kill one oh. of our so this is a trick so uh shout out to tragic star for thinking about this one we're gonna let him kill one of our great swords right this is bait so we just not put it on like the... no we play around the other um well if he plays expired ale it's gonna hit it no but the for you, my uh, friend. Right now, hopefully he'll kill it. I would imagine he would. Yeah. Oh. All right. So now we just go with the boat. I mean, he's got a witcher, right? I mean, uh, what was hoping for it? Do we muzzle his first Witcher? Ah, uh, we might. I should do. But if we, like before he anything, what are we going to do? Oh, Time to get our hands dirty. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Yes, let's muzzle. Let's muzzle that Witcher. Yeah, because if he can't res him. Uh, then, then we're going to do a uh, black hand into his covet. Right? Yeah. And then we're going to... That, that, that is going to be buff. So then he cannot kill that. Uh... Unless he plays... Um, yeah. Now, um, remind me how much damage does he does. He does five or six? Six. Okay, so then we can do it then on threes. Hopefully... He's gonna use ale again. Now, how yeah, well, like, I doubt that it's gonna block all of yeah. yeah, So we do on a six. Put it all the way in the back, just in case he kills. Yeah. And we kill the six. Onward! Or the five. Yeah, I figure kill that in case he has Calve. If, if he, or uh, Kahir. Because if he gets a big Kahir, that sucks. <clears throat> Would it buff? Oh, I see, I see, I see. Yep. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. So now we actually can do safely the Dude, the next great sword. We got to come up with 30 points. <laughs> That's going to be rough, dude. We're going to put one eight just straight up in between before the rest. It's going to be a witcher. Here's our chance. Well... They're hitting for 12. Then we'll put that in there. Yeah, like that. That's great. 
Dude, that's 40 points almost. 39? No. 35 points? 36? Man, it would have been so bad if we had uh, goals. <clears throat> So how can we do this? <clears throat> we got yeah, so, this, right? No, we can't. No. So what we're gonna do? We're going to re just Freya rest the guy and put it like all the way on the back. What? No, no, no. I mean, uh, Freya, not sit you out. Yeah. And we're gonna rest our eleven. So Mom here's where uh, Sirius is talking in. But put she brooks all the no way. insult. Here, right? Yeah, you can put it there. That's fine. I will flop off three heads with one blow. Okay, uh, can I see the graveyard? Two. So we only have that. All right, so this sucks, but yes. we're gonna, just going to put a bolt, normal bolt. Here. Yeah. What do we sacrifice? Another boat? Yeah, because we can res it. Yeah, all right. Let's go with that. I will put it on the great sword. The one that is about to heal. It's rough. Okay. If Octopus can somehow win, live. <laughs> it's probably not gonna happen. Oh, oh, let's well, let's throw it. Easy, easy, Molu. Yeah. <clears throat> and the Witchers are hitting for. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. So we res that one first. Oh, 13. No, 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 no. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We're going to do um, that. And we're going to yeah. put it next to Morvork on the right side. Yep. And we're going to rest in three. And we'll put it on the left side. And then now oh, that's going to start hitting me. Put a bolt. Case of rowers back. Now this is like the Can ultimate... Can we put it on Morvork? Because mm. it comes back for one turn. Sure. Let's go with it. Let's do maximize. I'm ready. We have to play Octus next turn. Yeah. We follow Letho. So there's one. Let's do the Oak. Let's let's make him use an Octus. Yeah. I wonder if he does the bait. We're gonna put the Freya on the bottom on the bottom row, just so we have space for our shenanigans. And we're going to rest our biggest. Yep, there it is. He had to kill it. Time to get all his witchers are dirty. gone. He's unless he burns one of the oak forts. So we. What do we res here? A captain? We can't res a captain. Can no, we? I think I think we just play the eight actually. Yeah. This is really bad. I'm yeah, Oh, we could have rest the boat. No, that's fine because he doesn't have more witchers. So right now we we are fine. But we're next we're going to rest. We're going to use Freya, bring a, a the two guy, and then he's gonna bring another guy to resurrect, and then we're gonna st start the engine. But I don't know if it's going to be enough to be completely honest. If he got if he got his goals, uh, we're screwed. Right, so put the Freya all the way in the bottom. On the bottom row. No. We, no! we needed to get the engine going. All right, so we raised the 13. Oh, you said Freya. Yeah. Oh, my right bad. Here for expired ale. Make a pitted. Sure. I will flopped off three heads with he one it. blow. Yeah, we missed a tick there. We're only up 
by 10. It depends if... if... Black blood. I guess that Ali can eat the... Ah, so... I would put another one on top. Yeah. And then we raise the two. Keep us. Yep. Position one. We raise the three. Cards are blowing fair winds the day. I can grab the premium. And make sure get ready, get ready for the cinematic, because we're about to get styled on with uh, Kahir. Yeah, he only needs fourteen points. One. Uh... One ale gets it for him, really. Damn it, man. What are our goals? <laughs> yeah, we didn't draw. <laughs> we drew... Muzzle, that was it. If he, Well, he doesn't have an answer for this. So he's got to res a... Alchemist? Now, yeah, but he's playing 14 go? points card, man. I don't know if two death cards that uh, under there. Okay. <gasps> that hits. Yeah, but like hey, that's it. It's... <coughs> oh my goodness! It'll it'll pop. It gets. Oh man! No, we win. What the <laughs> hell? <laughs> Wait, he, the he messed up. He would have. Yeah, he. <laughs> I, that's what I say. I. Oh, I, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I saw it and I'm like, he won. He just deletes the boat. You know, good oh game. <laughs> that's that's where we end it with uh, brand brand great swords. <laughs> Wow, dude. Um, yeah, the Aquist actually saved us there because he would have had uh, both. He would have had a removal for one of those great swords. Yeah, and just great. straight up like disclaimer. Like this deck will lose against that unless your opponent has a stroke, which uh, we're ending the video <laughs> so we can call, you know, proper authorities. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> my means we won that one. Yeah, that was great, dude. Um, do you got anything for the uh, wonderful Gwen community? Uh, I hope well, by the time you guys see this, uh, the homecoming video will be released. So uh, I'm watching it actually right now. Andy One's up one nothing on field by, so. Uh, oh man, I, I don't have a second monitor. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, just uh, happy for homecoming. Uh, I really have a lot of passion for this game, and I know the potential that it has. Um, I also know that a lot of people are working passionately about it, and I understand that we have to be patient. So, please, be good! <laughs> right. Yeah, it'll be good. We're, we're good. But, uh, hey, that's the video for today, guys. Like always, thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys.